Greetings, men of culture and ladies. Welcome to the realm, and this is Lily bringing you the latest news on the development progress of Shay and Tear, Explosive Cajun Tan. This is the first time we ever publish a death vlog, so please be kind and remember to leave your reaction. To start with this month's recap, I'd like to announce Shady Corner, all the way from Australia. In the upcoming time, Shady Corner will be our Steam co-publisher and together we will bring Shed and Tear to you. Shady Tim is well known for the publish of age-rated and furry games. Coming up next is the Art and Model Bulletin. From the Kajun Chan concept art that PDD posted, you must have known our waifu has two giant claws attached on her arms. Then, these are some ten commands. Let me remind you, they took over Earth and weaponized Kajun Chan. They look quite cute, but believe me, they are fast and furious. And on the screen is the prequel to the main story that happens in Shred and Tear, also called the introduction. Despite the trend of using 3D in cutscene with magnificent effects, our team chose the classic 2D hand-drawn comic strips. Other 90s throwback moments like these will be featured more in Shred and Tear for sure. We will continue with the latest updates on animation. You must have known our protagonist has quite some body figure, and this is her in action footage for you to admire. The bouncing is marvelous, right? And this is when Kajun Chan has to face the first boss in the game, Salomon. If you have never seen Salomon's model, here it is. Can you guess the food reference that we took for its name? Let's all moving on to the programming bulletin. If you are a 90s video game player, you must have come across this feature of emotion avatars. Since the camera will mostly be behind Kajun Chan, the changing avatar will help you with interaction with her as well as building attachment. Okay, suit up Kajun Chan. However, in this video, she's beaten up quite hard since the Tentamon troop is coming at her. The pace will be nowhere near idle. This is Kajun Chan again, but this time with professional voiceover. Let me tell you, Miss Pixie is also the voice artist behind Subverse Bao Chan. And I saved the best for last. This is the achievement of Shred and Tear on the media. First, we gotta mention Twitter. Right before the demo, we have gained 469,000 impressions. We are so thrilled about this. Thank you guys so much. Next, the Discord server. Even though the server is only one month old, but there are already 800 folks have joined and start queuing for the demo. And the most important figure, our total wish list on Steam. Last month, we only have like 2,500. The number up until now is 4,000s already. Yay to you, our supporters. To end the Lucid Realm news this month, let us show some appreciation to the assistance we got from the production team. And most important of all, you, our supporter. I'll see you next month. Bye!